So what is the distinction between Tantra and sex and what role does sex play in Tantra? I believe that sexual energy and sexual practices are part of the Tantric field. They represent a fraction of what is there. So imagine that the spirit of Tantra, like this giant god or goddess or entity, has been evolving over the last 3,000 years, right? And at some point in, in our human evolution, maybe 1,500 years ago, it incarnates itself to certain teachers and masters. They have those scriptures. This is classical Tantra. It's everything that happened in, uh, until the 20th century, maybe. Before that, this is classical Tantra, right? So in the, the Neo-Tantra movement, imagine that the spirit of Tantra keeps evolving. It's, it permeates everything. It's not just located in, in India. It arrives in the Western world, and it goes like, I am a compassionate being. I want to help humankind, right? Imagine mm -hmm. that this is the way it works. And then this being looks at, at the Western world. It says, you guys are having lots of pain around sex. There is lots of, lots of um, unspoken traumas and disturbances and things. Why don't we try to harmonize that together? Right? So the spirit of Tantra incarnates itself and brings certain teachers into the world. And then suddenly there is a whole new wave of teachings that is being activated. So for the, 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 the classical Tantra teachers, they say, oh, this is not the real thing. You know, we, we are going to discredit that and uh, position it as just some form of sensual and sexual gratification that has nothing to do with the origins of Tantra. Uh, in my experience, that's not the case at all. It's like, if we engage into tantric practices, sensual or sexual practices, uh, something is going to open up in our fields that we would not tap into otherwise. That is very, very healing for humankind. That represents one of the stepping stones in our evolution. So, of course, there are forces, gods and goddesses and spirits and, and intelligences that are working through us to bring new teachings.